if you lift heavy weight with a medium rep range or if you lift lightweight with a high rep range which one is faster to build more muscles hello folks scientific health with aka here we all know that if you want to build muscles you should shoot for a rep range between 6 and 12 and that weight should be kind of heavy but is this true though well this has some truth to it and that's why the American Society of Sports Medicine recommends hitting 8 to 12 reps of 60 to 70 percent one rep max. This means that the weight should be kind of heavy and you are hitting muscle failure in repetition number 12. But what if you have a light weight and you keep on ripping this weight until you reach muscle failure? Do you build muscles doing this? Well, this also might have some truth to it because you're going to reach muscle failure whether it is a lightweight or a heavyweight. To put an end to this dilemma, let's take a look at this study that investigated the effect of both light and heavyweight on muscle mass gains. The light group trained with 30% one rep max hitting 30 to 40 repetition, while the heavy group trained with 80% one rep max hitting 8 to 12 repetitions. Both groups reach muscle failure. And the duration for this study was 10 weeks of resistance training. And they found that both groups gained the same amount of muscles after finishing this 10 weeks resistance training period. What? I know, it's crazy. Now we have a big question. Does this mean that I have to take every set to muscle failure? Well, not quite really, because if you keep two reps in reserve, you can train as effectively as reaching muscle failure, and you will be able to recover and do more sets throughout the week. But how are you going to know that you are keeping two reps in reserve if you're not reaching muscle failure every now and then? My humble advice is to learn how to reach muscle failure first, and then you can arrange the rib range. It rhymes. We can safely say that lightweight or heavyweight does not really matter when it comes to increasing muscle mass. The most important thing is you train for God's sake. But remember, you have to reach muscle failure every now and then, and even if you're going to follow reps in reserve you have to know what muscle failure is and how it feels don't forget to take daily habits into consideration such as diet and sleep you can check out the other videos to learn more if you're interested